Okay, we're going to look at another box and whisker. This number here is 38. This number here is 72. This is 88. This is 96. And this is 102. This is what box and whisker plots tend to look like when they're drawn on a computer. So the first question, I know it's kind of small, it says, what was the high score on the test? Is that the high score? No. Is this? <laughs> no. This is the high score, isn't it? Apparently, somebody earned extra credit. The high score on the test was 102%. Good for them. What percent of the class scored above a 72? Well, the 72 is here. Remember, each section of a box and whisker plot represents 25%. So this is 25% of the students, this is 25% of the students, and this is 25% of the students. So apparently, 75% of my students scored above a 72. That's excellent. 75% got better than a C. What was the median score on the test? Remember, for median, I want the absolute middle. The absolute middle here is this piece of data, 88. What percent of the class scored between an 88 and a 96? Well, here's 88, here's 96. That's representing one section of my box and whisker plot so apparently, 25% of my students scored between an 88 and a 96 on this test.